so allergic to you. You're super cool. Good morning, super cool party people. I have found a cat and I am off to work. It's um, 20 after 8, give or take. And um, I don't know what the day is going to hold for weather. It's not raining, but it's very misty. I think there's a pretty good chance it'll rain. Um, so I'm just off to open the store now. And I'll try to remember to vlog better today. Nothing like starting the day and there's already someone at the front door waiting for you. It's just 8.30 now and I've already dealt with the customer, but it's fine. I like, I feel like I'm a mess right now, but I'm here. My morning partner, who I didn't get to have our mornings together with because she had a taxi run, is back. So that's exciting so I don't have to run down the fuel dock. And yeah, if you forget what the store looks like, here is a brief overview. Whee! All right, I'm gonna go get to work now, I suppose. And now the dock is super empty and we have a strudel laying in the rain because she's a weirdo. But yeah, it's just completely turned. Only two boats on the dock. The rest are ours, pretty much. And now I'm just waiting to go for lunch, which hopefully will happen soon because I'm hungry and fresh bread. I'm so excited about this. I already bought my loaf. I'm just waiting to get relieved so I can go consume it. I'm so excited. It is raining so hard right now. I am not impressed. I do not like. I do not like at all. I'm getting wet. I should have zipped up my jacket. I made a poor life choice. I'm now relieved. I'm gonna go make some food. <laughs> and then hopefully maybe get some writing done. I've been being pretty productive lately. I found out that I likely get to keep my desk or if nothing else, they'll find me a different desk. So win-win. Anyways, I'm gonna go now. There's nobody here. I still feel weird talking to myself. Oh well. Oh, it is rainy and cold today and I'm so sleepy. It's raining so much. It's just ridiculous to be honest. Like, I don't know if you can see that on here but there's just so much rain <laughs> oh I, I mean i still have like an hour and a bit before i have to go back outside i'm not looking forward to it i've changed into the long sleeve shirt again because it's so cold and i was gonna try to write but i'm almost done this book that i started reading when i was here in november and so i kind of want to finish that because i'm close to the end so i might as well i can write later it is it's so miserable outside. Ooh. Anyway, day's going well. Like, it was super busy today. Not, like, customer-wise, really, but, like, we got a liquor order in, and that's always a lot to put out. And, yeah, just random things. We lost the mail key. It was in my boss's pocket, even though I asked him if it was in his pocket. And he was like, nope, I never put it in my pocket. And then his wife was like, is it in your pocket? And then he found it in his pocket. So, um, yeah, just lots of random things happening today and people in town and so much rain anyway i'm rambling i think i am just gonna lay down and read for a bit I've, i'm on break till 4 30 today because i got relieved late so that's good i've still got over an hour i should be able to finish reading this within the next like half hour and then maybe i'll do some editing but i think probably not because i don't really want to so yeah yeah Alrighty, so I finished my book. It was the fifth book in a series and the last one and it was just a really boring and predictable ending so Kind of disappointed, but I mean it wasn't that great of a series in the first place That's part of the reason why it took me so long to get through it and also because I don't really read when I'm not out here because I'm usually writing but I think I've got like a decent balance of reading and writing because there's really nothing else to do my boss keeps saying, oh, the Wi-Fi works in the back house. Well, it does not. It does not at all. So, yeah, lots of time to do other things. And because it's so rainy, again, you probably can't see that, but because it's so rainy, I just don't feel like being down in that gazebo because, ugh. Anyway, it's about 10 after 4 now, so I'm going to start getting myself ready to go down. I decided to put on some makeup because why not? It's a miserable day. Let's bring some life to the face. And, um, yeah, I don't, maybe I'll bring the camera down. I'll bring the camera down and we'll see if I actually vlog while I'm down there. We'll see. It's gonna be busy because our order from town should be showing up soon, I guess. I don't know. At some point, I don't know. I don't know when they were leaving town. Anyway, so that'll be something to deal with and put away and sort and all that fun stuff.
goodness, my body is so sore. I was laying on the couch and the other girls were going to leave to go down to um, Strudel's mom's house and I couldn't get up. <laughs> I was like, you yeah, know I'm just going to stay here. I managed to get up, I did my dishes and I'm going to change into pajamas, I think, or sweats or something. Try to get a little bit of writing done and then um, maybe have an early night. I'm not tired, my body is just tired. It just needs to lay down and do nothing. So I think we're going to accommodate that. There was, it was a very slow day, but there was just a lot of stuff to do. And then I'm learning how to do invoicing and billing for water taxi runs. So that's a new and exciting thing that my brain was just like, Pow! um, I think we'll do more of it tomorrow. Uh, it's not so much like I understand the invoicing and like the receivable side, like that's going to be easy to pick up. The issue is just the nautical miles and plotting runs and stuff. That's what's going to completely just... So I'll probably end up going out on a couple of boat rides over the next little while so I can figure out where places are. So that'll, that'll be exciting. That'll be fun. Last year I got off this island once to go all the way up to Thompson Sound, which is like, I think it was two and a half hours there and two and a half hours back. It was a long run, but yeah. Um, I got pointed out a few of the places on the way, but I don't remember. That was a long time ago. But yeah, so I think I'm going to get into some comfy clothes. Pajamas. Yeah, it's going to be pajamas. And then try to sit down and write for a bit. So that's exciting. If I get super ambitious, maybe I'll edit yesterday's vlog, but I probably won't. But maybe I will. We'll see. It's still miserable outside, but I'm okay because I don't need to go out in it anymore. I haven't done like anything on the internet in days because it's raining too much and I don't want to go sit in the gazebo. So, you know, it's kind of cool. It's chill. I enjoy it. But um, yeah, I'm going to go now and I'll check back in with you in a bit. Probably, hopefully after having been productive. My book is closing in on 130,000 words. That is insane. That is a lot of words. Um, I'm just starting chapter 30 right now, which should be a quick edit. I think 31 is going to be quick as well, but then I think I need to write another chapter at 32. So I'm probably going to try to get through. It's 9.30 right now. I'm probably going to get through. I'm probably going to try to get through chapter 30 and maybe 31 and then probably call it a night. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. It's yeah, I'm just tired. I'm tired. I would like to sleep. So yeah, that's the plan. So I will continue to edit and I will let you know how far I got. And um, yeah, sounds, it's been a pretty productive day. I think my body hurts. That's what's tired. It's my body, but we'll keep going. And yeah, I can't believe I've only been out here for like two full days, three full days, three full days. I feel like I've been out here forever. It just feels like home. It's nice. And plus having so many staff come back from last year, it's good. Alrighty, well, it is the end of the night now, kind of. It's 10. I don't know what time it is. Where's my phone? It's 10.30, so I'm gonna go to sleep because I can. Why not? I'm not even that tired. I just try and get into routine. So with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night!